Welcome back to Waz Today, where Waz Today is Neptune 1982 release running here on the Apple II Plus in Virtual 2 from uh, Nasir Jabelli and Jabelli Software Incorporated. It's Neptune. This is a horizontal shooter with uh, keyboard controls, IJKM uh, for directions, and then A for laser blast, and Z for bomb. Got a little bit of a non-standard bomb path in this game. So I just I just spam the bombs. You got uh, you got 20 bombs to start. You got five lives to start. A little bit generous, uh, but uh, we're gonna roll with it and see. It's kind of a kind of a big sprite style shooter that you see more on the Apple II. You don't really see this on the NES just due to, due to the sprite hardware. Um, this is more on the like the family computer or microcomputer systems. I don't want to say family computer because the it makes it sound like I'm talking about the Famicom, which had sprite, sprite hardware. The Apple II is just a computer, it doesn't know anything about sprites. Why would it? Um, anyway, you're bombing these guys and uh, blasting these other guys, but uh, let's see how far we can get here in Neptune. The, uh, the IJKM controls are not the best for me, personally, just my keyboard is not... Those aren't really uh, comfortable to use for both directions at the same time. <laughs> it also has the problem of most keyboard controls where, you know, you gotta uh, hit the opposite direction to stop going in the direction you started going in. I don't know why did, that guy didn't count for me, but... This here is a section that, uh, I have actually played a little bit of this before, just before firing this up. This section... Seems to randomize as to whether the top or bottom kills you, and you have no way of telling up front. Uh, so it looks like I chose correctly that time. That's good, good game design right there, right? Um, it's got a 50-50 chance of whether or not you're gonna die. And we can't shoot here, or drop bombs. Uh, we're in a section where we can't do that. And then here we gotta avoid uh, these a other aliens that are flying at us. And you can't just uh, chill at the top or bottom, because those tiny little pixels, they'll also kill you. You just try to hang out up here. You see him drifting around uh, down there at the top and bottom, and those alcoves. This game said no alcoves. You can't just you can't just chill in an alcove. Uh, we're not gonna let that happen. You gotta do some active avoidance. Um, and we'll see here once we get through this. Uh, there is a fuel tank. We're running out of fuel. At highly dangerous rate. Uh, but I've never successfully refueled yet, so we'll see if I can figure that out just now. Uh, I looked at the back, and it says you have to go to the, uh, down and to the right of the fuel container. We did it! We're refueling, okay. If you're, if you're on top of the fuel container, you'll just explode. If you try to do anything else, you'll just explode. If you try to go right, it won't let you. Uh, so you gotta know exactly what you're doing. Clearly I don't. I didn't know that was gonna... <laughs> I don't know what we're doing now. We're upside down. This is level two. This is the first time I've seen this. Everything is... crazy. We're bombing upside down. Okay. I'm glad I got to see this, because otherwise I would have had a very different impression of this game. It's very easy if you don't have that manual telling you exactly where to go for that fuel tank. Uh, never to figure out how to... Um, how to get past that fuel tank. I just spent the last 20 minutes uh, trying to get past that fuel tank with no luck. This feels very bad. <laughs> upside down. I don't know why it feels so bad upside down, but uh, it does. Let's see. High score of 2,350. Let's try again with Neptune here. Maybe a little bit more of Neptune. See if we can show it off. Do those things actually kill you on this level? It doesn't seem like they do. It seems like they're just drifting around, but I could be wrong. I don't think I've died from one of those on this level. Those little Pac-Men. They're kind of floating around. Missed the guy. Oh man. Oh, that was close. Oh, they they blocked my bomb though. Ah. Perilous times here. Okay. Probably if I wanted to play this seriously, I'd map the keyboard onto my joystick.
All right. Now we got a choice. You can go down this time. Let's see. I, I'm feeling it. Let's see. Who knows? Uh, I chose poorly. I chose poorly. But at least it will spawn you past this point. We'll just be right into these uh, jellyfish or whatever they are. Space jellyfish. See if we can uh, refuel correctly again at the end of this. If we get to the end of this, you know. Oh man, it didn't make it there. Those tiny little pixels will kill you. Not nearly as bad on uh, fuel this time because we just died. It's another way to refuel if you want to. Probably not as good. If you want to get a high score. Alright, let's see. Gotta go down to the right. But presumably there's a tolerance where it's too far right. But that's good enough. Let's fuel up. Get right into upside down level two. Maybe I should just try to survive. What do you think? Did I go in for points? Oh man. It is it is definitely harder. Also, it's just disorienting because it's upside down. I mean, everybody finds being upside down a little bit disorienting, right? Especially bombing upside down. Like, nobody's good at that. That's not it. And the game just made the that's not it sound, so, you know. Wow, that was close. Okay. Whenever one of those things goes off screen, I'm never, I, I never know if, like, it's going to come back down on me. Come back up on me on this level, as it were. Even the controls are confusing when it's upside down. I don't know why. It shouldn't be. Missed him. I don't know. I'm just trying to get through it. Alright, we got these guys now. If we get to the 50-50 uh, choice again and die there on our last ship, I'm going to be a little bit displeased, let's say. What do you think we should do? Go up or down? Let's go up. We chose wisely. Perhaps. I'm going to assume we're going to go back to the same thing here. And then this just repeats. I don't know. We might run out of fuel before we get through this, though. Yeah. That guy's coming right for me. Are they a little bit faster this time? It feels that way. I could be wrong. Man. Oh, that, that was quite close. I'm just trying to get to my fuel. Guys. Just let me get some fuel. Oh, man. Well, that's a fitting end here for me with uh, Neptune. And I think that's going to do it here for me with uh, Neptune for Waza Day. And if you like uh, early Apple II arcade games like this, then go ahead and subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow for our next Waza Day.